Hey guys, this is Deepan Gover, technical analyst of Allies Group. So in this video, I'll discuss about Zinc. Now you can see Zinc. Uh, this is Zinc daily time frame, and you can see according to the moving average crossover, Zinc is running in a downtrend. But if you wanna see the price action method, Zinc are uh, trading higher high, higher low, higher high, and higher low. Right now, you can see Zinc is following moving average 20. Have you seen? Price is bouncing from moving average 20, bouncing from moving average 20, and uh, bouncing from moving average 20 in a daily time frame. And 20 moving average now forming a uh, support as a and acting as a supporting line here. We have seen already, right? uh now let's take a look here if you want to see according to the uh pattern chart pattern so you can say like that had uh what call cup and handle like that pattern but from here we have seen but it is okay but most of the people are using like that and uh, most of the time most of the people are using like a flag pattern like that all right whatever they are forming so we need proper entry and exit point right so let's check it in a four hour time frame and the four hour time frame we have seen this is a higher point lower point a higher point a lower point and uh, right now in a four hour time frame we have seen uh, this is 100 moving average uh, uh, forming a support line uh, 100 moving average uh, it, it is acting as a supporting level and there are right now price is running in this range in a four hour time frame so we can say like that sideways market right let me draw some support and resistance line here this is a support and i think this is a resistance line right so we have seen this is a resistance line right now price is running in this range this is our trading range so if you want to enter for the buy you uh, wait to break this level of 186 right 186 and we are looking for a candle close above this area so we can go for buy right and if you want to see in a 15 minute time frame how it will look like that now in a 15 minute time frame it will look like that right it will look like that and most of the people are thinking here they broke this 200 moving average start by but we have seen there is a resistance and that is why you just wait to break this resistance line and after that you can go for buy and if you find any sell signal here so you can go for short again and the target will be somewhere here. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.